So, let's see it. Come on. Not moving. Uh, all right. But, uh... It's a little small. <laughs> yeah, well, if I had a real job, that might help, man. My man, heading for the good life. Slow down a little bit. Uh, sure. You gonna be okay? Yeah, I'll be fine. It's not too much further. Uh, how about here? This is good. Oh, we're almost to the top. How, how about just here? For what? What do you mean? I, uh... You gonna be okay? Just, uh, I guess I have something. What is it? Is it an iPod? It's not. Say it's an iPod. It's not. <laughs> You're expecting an iPod? I'm not expecting, just hoping. It's not an iPod. <laughs> yes. I haven't even asked. Yes! Yes! Ella, she said yes. Yes to what? Like getting a pizza or? Yeah, Josh. She said yes to getting a pizza. No, I. No, no. Oh, congratulations. Seriously, I'm, I'm happy for you. Me too. I mean, I'm, I'm happy. I mean, <laughs> yeah, she's great. Yeah. She is. Where are we going to live? Anywhere you want. I mean, like, right now. Am I gonna move in with you, or are you gonna move in with me? Whatever you want. It's forever, you know. Yeah, I certainly hope so. How do you know? How do I know what? That this is what you want. I know. How do you know? Uh, I just know. I know, but how do you know? I know. <clears throat> yeah, but how do you know? I mean, it's forever. And it's not always gonna be like this. I mean, we're 25 and seven years ago we were in high school. And I never would have dated someone like you in high school. Th thank you. No, just, you know what I mean. People change. I mean, how do you know that in seven years from now, you're still going to feel the same way you do now? You mean seven years from now when you're running your own gym? Fitness center. F fitness center. And I'm opening for you too? When you two is opening for you. <laughs> oh, okay, okay then. Well, when that time comes, I promise I will love you so much more than I do right now. And I don't know how that's possible, because right now I love you more than 
I love you more than, more than I, I don't know what. I love you so much, and I always will. Good answer. Play a little bit. Just a weddings? I had a couple of games for a while, but then Where is he? I woke him up. It's, it's almost like your wedding again, isn't it? We have to do this, Dad, right now. Really? What are you doing, dude? What's going on? Yeah. I, I don't know where I am. I woke up in some weird house. That's funny. I, mean, I, can't, I can't find my glasses. I, I can't see anything. Your contacts are by the bathroom sink. I don't put stuff in my eyes. Where are my glasses? Are you serious? Is that why you're not here seriously? Because you can't find your glasses? What? Look, I don't know what's going on, okay? I. I, I don't know where I am. You know, I have no I I feel weird. <laughs> Is this your house? What when did you move? Yeah, you're you're hungover. Um I'm gonna come pick you up. Just just uh hang tight. Where is the shower? I don't know. It's, I'm gonna go get him. Jack, you bring him here, you don't screw this up. Yeah. Nasty ass grape soda floats right now. That's a good idea. Okay. What's going on? You tell me. Ah, oh, come on, John. You're supposed to be at the place. What are you talking about? What the hell's going on? Okay, believe me, I. I get what you're feeling here. I, I know it can be. You're getting married. People do it every day. Not today. Even today. I'm not getting married today. What's the problem? What's the problem? The problem is... You know, this isn't funny, okay? You, you started to freak me out. You're freaking me out! I have a headache. <laughs> I'm not surprised. What does that mean? Nothing. I don't... Nothing. You just... You seemed kind of hammered when you got back last night. Saying weird stuff. I got engaged last night. What? <laughs> it's great. You're not here and you're not answering your phone. You know, you're ruining everything. I hope you know you are ruining everything. You know, I just... I... Jackass. You seriously don't remember the last six months of excruciating wedding planning, of trying to pick out the exact right floral arrangements for that arch thing and, and, and the cake and, and, and the china patterns? Really? And you're serious about this? You're completely serious? I hope you're serious. 
Because this would be a pretty horrible trick to plan an entire wedding party, not to mention the cost of... Now I'm talking to myself. Yeah, with me in the room. Okay. <laughs> I mean, what? What? <laughs> Dad's gonna think this is all my fault. I mean, I don't know how it could be, but he's gonna find a way because that's what Dad does. What do I do? And I mean, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> well, you gotta go through with this. People flew in from all over. How can I? This girl is the best thing that's ever happened to you, correct? I... Yeah. Well then... But... You were ready to marry her six months ago when you... Or... Last night to you when you proposed. Yeah, yeah but I mean... It's... <laughs> but you... What? But not this morning, okay? <laughs> How is it different? I don't know. Yeah, I guess it's not. So then... Okay. Yes, okay. My glasses somewhere, I mean, I can't see anything. No, it's not cold feet, it's just... Okay, I'll explain when we get there, okay? Just... fine. You know, you're a big guy, and this is a tiny car. Fuel efficient. Yeah, since when do you care about fuel efficiency? Since gas hit four bucks a gallon? Yeah, right. <laughs> okay, listen. I'm sorry about the whole freak out thing that I did. It... You feeling all right though? I mean, aside from I suppose. Shoot, Jack, I've I've never even met her family. I'm not going to know anyone there. Where have you guys been? You were supposed to be here half an hour ago. Well, his car broke down. I went to pick what, him up. What? And that took half an hour? We've all been waiting for you. I'm sorry. Well, he's here just... now, so Ugh. You you need to get down there right now, or I'm gonna whip your throat out and stuff it down your neck hole. Wait, you're gonna, you're gonna what now? I will kill you dead. What? Who is that? Who are you? Dude. I'm sorry, everybody. Um. <laughs> <laughs> I knew it. I knew that something like this was you, but I told you. Don't even go times anywhere. Did I tell you, Rachel? How many times did you listen to how and look and upstairs to talk away from you on your wedding day because he doesn't know you? Matt! Where is Nicole? Nicole. You guys broke up like Six years ago. No, no, that's impossible. No, you got you got engaged, moved in together. <laughs> you started planning the wedding, and like three weeks before you were supposed to get married, you freaked out and broke up with her. It was, and then and then what? <laughs> and then what? And then nothing. I mean, 
she ended up she's married to another guy oh, wait so you thought what year is it it's 2010 are you telling me that I've lost seven years of my life I'm not telling you anything except that it's 2010 no that's impossible that's impossible it's very possible this is actually kind of funny I mean you had me going there for a second, you know? Do you have everyone in on it? Is that... Not a joke, Matt. I mean, it's to go as far as flying our mom and dad in? I did fly mom and dad in for a wedding, not for... And to hide my glasses? You wear contacts now! I mean, whose house was that? This is not a joke. It's 2010. You and Nicole broke up like six years ago, and... And you're marrying Rachel today, and Rachel is... What was she said last night? She's your soulmate. My soulmate? Yeah, you said... Well, I said a lot of things, actually. It was actually kind of uncomfortably personal. You said, she's your soulmate. She makes you happy. They're your whole life, her and Shay. So, her and Shay? Shayla. Her daughter. Her what now? You know, I'm gonna let you two talk it over, but... Everything's gonna be totally fine. Everything's gonna be totally fine. Totally fine. Okay, I wish I could explain, but... Okay, the truth. I, okay, uh, I went to bed last night and it was 2003. And, uh, I woke up and it was today. I know, it sounds ridiculous. And the thing is, is last night I went to bed and I was engaged to someone else. And it was weird enough waking up thinking I was marrying her today. And then to see you standing there. Sorry, that sounded... No, it's fine. Now, I totally understand if you think I'm nuts. I believe you. But wouldn't you believe me? Yeah, except the same thing happened to me. <laughs> You're making fun of me. No. Rachel, this is weird writing to you. First thing, she is your daughter. Her name is Shayla. When you read this, you're not going to remember anything. You think it's 2003 and you think the last, the last night you got engaged to Todd. Seven years have passed since then. Turn on the TV and you'll see for yourself. Heather, your maid of honor, whom will not remember meeting, will be here at 8 to take you, take you to your wedding. You're marrying a man named Matt. I know you don't believe in them now, but one day you'll realize that Matt is your soulmate. Go through with this, Rachel. Sign, Rachel. Yes. Matt's blind with that. He's take the poor guy's glass. Who's this? No. So, you wrote your, you wrote yourself a letter, meaning that you knew we were gonna lose our memories. First of all, I'm still pretty sure this is all just a dream. No, it's not a dream unless I'm, I'm the one having it. Well, that would mean that I don't really exist, and I know I do. So. Okay. <laughs> all right. Well, philosophical arguments aside, you knew we'd lose our memories. Well, it doesn't say anything in there about you losing yours. But, I mean, but you wrote yourself a letter. No. I, I, I don't know. I found a letter which I appear to have written. Yes. What, what about the guy that you, you, you were supposed to marry? I mean, do you, I mean, do you know where he is? I don't know. He, 
See, I was already pregnant when he proposed. You didn't love him? You, I mean, you, you don't? No, I do. I, I mean, I, I did. It's just... I think he felt like he had to marry me. You know, so I guess I'm just not surprised that things ended up the way that they did. What am I saying? <gasps> I'm talking like this is real, like this is a real thing, and it's not real. I don't know. What about, what about your girl, your fiance? What happened there? Was it the same kind of thing? No. No, I mean, she wasn't, she wasn't pregnant. No, it's not. Actually, I mean, I, I feel... I mean, I, I don't know how it possibly... Apparently, it just fell apart. And you know, she's married to some other guy. And she was ripped away from me, and I don't, I don't know why. Are you kidding me? This is... What? Wait, so you were listening the whole time? Yes, I was. And no one's denying that this whole thing is messed up. But this is what you two are going to do. You're going to go back there, and you're going to give these people the wedding they came here to see. No. I can't. Y yes, you are. What about... Let me see. The, the... One day, you'll realize that Matt is your soulmate. I don't believe in soulmates. Yes, you do. And, and Matt, if you could have heard yourself talking last night, I mean, and just look at her. I mean, you guys are meant to be. We don't even know each other. So what? I mean, I know you guys, and I know... Uh, but... Okay, uh... Okay. Okay, how much do you trust yourselves? What? How much do you trust yourselves? I mean, just because you guys don't remember it doesn't mean there isn't a history. Just because you guys don't remember, I mean... So... Just... Okay, uh... Don't screw this up for your other selves. I mean, your memories are going to come back eventually, probably. And just, I mean, just think how pissed those other people, you, are going to be when you they find out that you screwed everything up for them, you, yourselves. Yeah, I'm making sense, right? Actually, yeah, you sort of are. And should I be totally wrong, which I'm not, an annulment is a hell of a lot cheaper than throwing another wedding. So there's that. I now pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. What am I doing here? You told me to come. Yeah, but that was... You should go, actually. Uh, I didn't want to come. I, I said it would be awkward. And you said, no, it won't be I awkward. Know, you have to come. So I came, and now you're telling me I have to go? There's complications. It's yeah. tough to... Really no! I'm not... Fine. Let me say congratulations, and then I'll go. No, you really should yeah, go now. I need to help out your own people. Hi. Sorry, guys. Congratulations. Okay, okay. <laughs> Beautiful. Fantastic. Thank you. Thanks. Uh, you look good. Thanks. Uh, so, uh... So? You're here. I'm here. Where's your, uh, <clears throat> husband? He's, a. Uh... He's not here yet, uh, so she's not here. Seriously, can't leave me alone out there with all these. Hi. Hi. I'm Nicole. Rachel. Congratulations. He is a great guy. Thanks. How, how do you know each other? 
We were. Oh, we're um, uh, we're old friends. Could you come back out with me? Yeah, I mean, we were just. I, oh no, you should go. It was good to see you. Congratulations again. What was that all about? Weird, right? Why does he think I'm married? You should go, though. That was weird. I wouldn't worry about it, but uh, you should go. I mean, he knows, right? Knows what? <laughs> knows what? Yeah, he knows. Yeah, he, he totally knows. You know he knows. Because he didn't act like it. He knows. You said you told him. I, <laughs> I did tell him. I told him. He just... It's complicated. Did you tell him I'm married? <sighs> Why would I? No. Because the way he hugged me just now, it was... I don't know. Jack, what did you tell him? Oh, I could use another one of those. Or three. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's weird. I, I can't believe I can legally drink now. <laughs> uh-huh. Wait, how old are you? He was born in 83, so... He's 27. Why, how old are you? I guess I would be 32. Holy oh, crap, I'm in my 30s. Ah, oh, that's... He's so old. <laughs> what are you like talking about? <laughs> Alright, I... This is not, uh... Nicole, is she... Yeah. She's married? She doesn't look married. Married people have a look? Do we, do we look married? No. She doesn't wear a ring. I, I don't think she's married. But Jack... I think... I can't believe I'm saying this, because uh, we just got married, but I mean... If, if there's a chance, maybe she... I knew this was going to happen. I know. And you were right. <laughs> I'm sorry. Things get really confusing. Just... All right, look. I'm going to go, and you're going to fix this. Yeah. Straighten things out. Uh-huh. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. But I was thinking, obviously, I got to stick around here a little bit longer, and then I got to take my parents to the airport. And they're leaving on their honeymoon. Which means they won't be around, so if you wanted to come over later. Really? <laughs> I don't see why this should change anything. You don't. I don't. Of course, if you don't want to come. Well, that would depend. On? What would we do? <laughs> Let's just say it involves a leaf blower and three American Idol finalists. Mm-hmm. Well, as long as one of them is Taylor Hicks. So that's a yes, then. Should I bring anything? I thought you were going to talk to I'm him. I'm going to go talk to him. No, I'll go talk to him. Tell me what? And I wasn't even gonna come. And I would have told you if I had known. Tell me what? We're, um, sort of dating. You're, you're sort of dating? Yeah, for a few weeks, a couple months. Okay, whoa, 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 wait, wait, wait. Okay, I want an explanation. Okay, you owe me that much. No, I don't owe you anything. You're with him? With, with my brother? This is you, in a nutshell, right here. What is that supposed to mean? Your irrational freak outiness. It's so you. You know, you don't say anything that makes any sense. You never explain anything rationally. It's. Oh my gosh. Oh, this is so you. Jack, uh, 
it's Jack, right? Yeah. I, uh, I don't know anyone out there. Yeah. Why are you acting like this? It's none of your business who I'm dating, who I'm sleeping okay, with. Okay, no. You got married today. Not only do you not have a right to be upset, it's downright inappropriate. Yeah, but you don't... But no buts. But Jack! Why do you care? Because you're... This is wrong, Matt. It's cool. Why are you doing this? You married a beautiful girl. You love her. Why are you doing this? Because you wouldn't understand. Okay. I love you. Don't. No, don't do that. Oh, I knew this was a bad idea. I knew I shouldn't have come. I've always loved you. Stop it! Stop! I don't know what is going on with you, Matt, but stop! You left me. You left me without a reason and without an explanation. And I moved on. And so did you. And I don't know where this is coming from. Do you remember when you ran into us three weeks ago? Fresh my memory. Jack and I were at the cafe and you came in. And that's when I told him to tell you that we were, you know, just so you'd know. And we were just gonna bump into you, but whatever. You had this smile on your face. Matt, you gotta know, it kills me to tell you this, but I've never seen you look so happy. Look, I wish it wasn't true. I wish you wouldn't have gotten over me the way you did. You said you were getting married, and when you left, Jack said he's never seen you look so happy as when you're with her. She's your soulmate. You keep saying that. I don't know what it means. Thought bright jumps down. <laughs> okay, man. What, what are you doing? Alright, alright, I'm a guitar. Whatever. Yeah, I'm like, 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 I'm Hey, listen, by the way, I give it one year tops. Why, 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 why? Just saying. Why would you say that? Why would someone say that? Because that someone is Stephen. He's not normal. Sorry. I am so sorry about the cake. What's wrong with the cake? Oh, it's, it's not the right cake. I don't know what happened. I'm really sorry. It's fine. Is it? Yeah, it's, it's a beautiful cake. I, I need know. to talk to you. Arm. Do you know where your husband is right now? Husband? <laughs> That's weird. Do you know where he is? Yeah, he's at He's with his ex-girlfriends. His ex fiance How's it going, ladies and gentlemen? I told you this would happen. This I next told song you, is by the Rachel. Room you remember that night the at the club? He's not up here singing it himself. It's only been an hour, he was afraid Rachel. to he's forget the lyrics. What's up, bro? I told you. I All told right. you way back at the first yogurt shop or even that night when we went to the club. I told you, Rachel.
my life.